Hi everybody, welcome to another career tutorial. I'm Kreitman. And what we're going to do this time through is we're going to uh, mess with distribution a little bit. Uh, let's go ahead and drop a plane into our scene. And let's go ahead and make a sphere. Size it down a little bit. Because we're going to be distributing it uh, all over the plane. And that should be good enough. Let's go ahead and edit the color so we can see it. and now we're ready to go now I have a texture that I made uh, via Carrera actually and uh, I have it uh, set over here Let's load my texture map and it's called fractal PSD and you notice that it's a black and white image it's a black and white image uh, that's kind of important you need dark colors and you need light colors for this to work um, there we go. Let's go ahead and turn our turn this on. And there we go. Now we can see what we're trying to do. Now you notice that uh, uh, there's a very specific pattern that it has. Um, that's what we want. That's what we want it to do. Um, yeah. Let's go ahead and uh, drop our surface replicator in here. And nothing happens. Let's jump into the surface replicator room and choose um, plane to be distributed on and we're going to add sphere and you notice that there's just a random bunch of spheres all over the place let's fix that uh, let's go ahead and jump into our plane and let's just copy the color we don't need anything else let's just copy the color and jump to our surface replicator and you notice where it says objects distribution go ahead and use shader edit the shader and then just paste right here quick and easy and you notice that the spheres have kind of uh, started lining up onto the to the uh, white on the object now you can probably get a better distribution out of this if you want to um, do best you notice that it's starting to align a little bit better um, minimum distance you can go ahead and mess with that and probably get a little bit of distribution out of it bump the number of objects up bump the number of objects up and you see that it's all over the all over it and it pretty much has made an outline of the shape that we made so anyway, uh, that's it. That's a quick, easy tip on how to uh, distribute your objects via um, your shader. So anyway, that's it for this time. I'm Kreitman, and I'll talk to you again later.